Wearing it down from Carmen Essen, Bonanova out deep. Macaulay Lass hit the front on the inside. Fellowship driving with on the outside, Bonanova. Bonanova's dived. It may have got up in the last stride, Bonanova. Or Nicola Lass and close up Fellowship. A great go to the last. Behind those is Carmen Essen from Rainbow Bubbles. Further back in the race then, Nova Claus, followed by Fairy Tales, Angel Spirit. Then Flickering Fire, Canietta, Hula Wonder. Well back in the race then, Listening's Joy with Gift Tannery and Drink Card Princess. It's got it. Number one, Bonanova has got up to win. 4.40 and 2.40 here. Second in number seven, Nicola Lass at $3.10. Third at 16, Fellowship at $7.80. The photo. Number one, Bonanova's got it. 4.30, 2.20 over seven, Nicola Lass. 3.30 and 16 for third, Fellowship. Place dividend of 7.20. The three's back for a bundle. Gave them a huge start. Has worn down Nicola Lass and Fellowship in the dying stages of the race. And Jimmy makes it three for the day with Bonanova. Who you wouldn't have given much chance to at the 200 after Fellowship had scooted away two to three in front. Nicola Lass went back to the inside of her from Carmenesque and then Bonanova was starting to storm down the outside with big strides and it wasn't until right on the line that Bonanova has grabbed them to win with all the momentum was finishing with. About 4.30 over the line. It will pay 4.30. One... All right, the totes. One, seven, 16, Bonanova. 4.40 and 2.40, seven, Nicola Lass, $3.10. Six Fellowship, seven eighty. The Quinella, thirty dollars sixty. Exact of fifty three forty. The Trifecta, one seven sixteen, one thousand five hundred ninety one dollars fifty. The Daily Double, seven Le Trois and one Bonanova is one hundred and fifty eight dollars eighty. And the special dividend, twenty dollars twenty. Fives into three solid. A second mare, the Cola last sevens out to ten. All right. Uh, this is Triple S, the Good Sports. Two minutes to uh, five on this. Uh, Saturday afternoon of racing so the next uh, race number 8 in Tasmania in about 30 seconds from now and then we'll be going back to Toowoomba just get those Toowoomba figures up on the screen if we can for the uh, next let's see if it's up on this screen let's see VR yes there we go VR the code for Toowoomba race number 2 and down the board Toowoomba race 2 number 1 pure trade 12 382 we're off in the last of the day and immediately putt out the back and a haunting spirit straight to the lead from Sarek and Toro. Deeper is Speaker's Bureau and then a gap of a length and a half to Gracida, Mr. Bureaucrat, and then Bill Quattro going up between horses from Valence. A length and a half to punt, racing up on the inside of Diabolical, two to Sound and two to King of Atlantis. Along past the 1200 they travel and a haunting spirit really keen to run in the lead. He's a couple of lengths on Sarek. Toro travels third, then Speaker's Bureau about two and a half to Mr bureaucrat racing alongside Gracida another length and three quarters to two further back Bill Quattro punt then Valence wider out about two lengths further off in the field is Diabolical his stable mate sound is second last and absolute being king of Atlantis by golly haunting spirit wants to bolt in the lead and coming along past the halfway he's out about a length and a quarter on Sarek a good way back in the third spot is Toro a couple Gracida and speakers bureau about two and a half to Mr bureaucrat the popular pick he's on the outside of punt and then Bill Quattro deeper still is Valence followed by Sound Diabolical is back to second last and last is King of Atlantis it's Haunting Spirit the leader as they come around the corner he's getting a bit wide he's about four or five off the inside rail he straightens up about a length and a half on Sarek six lengths to Toro Gracida followed by Mr. Bureaucrat and then Speaker's Bureau Haunting Spirit's rider starts to pull the persuader now I refer to Brent Stanley Sarek still about two lengths behind him and another two lengths to Mr. Bureaucrat Haunting Spirit in front Mr. Mr. Bureaucrat is coming home. Great guns now. Haunting Spirit stopping. Mr. Bureaucrat lunged at him. And there won't be much between Haunting Spirit and Mr. Bureaucrat as the line has been reached. Very close. Sarek was next. And then came Valence with King of Atlantis making up many lengths. Bell Quattro, Gracida, Toro, Speaker's Bureau, Punt. And the stable mates were the last two. I refer to Sound and Diabolical. Close go. Seven Haunting Spirit. 1473.50. Three, Mr. Bureaucrat, will be a dollar fifty for the place. Two ten if it happened to get it, and uh, we'll stand by for third there. Let's go back to Kel. Yes, thanks, uh, Paul. Pretty close go. I thought uh, Haunting Spirits hung on here in the last, but it's a pretty close go. Ramwick, uh, plenty of people downstairs are on the favourite there. Uh, race 10, Anki's Bonfire, the winner number 6 at 5 to 4, Fave, Title Chance number 1, second at 5, Zendor Carter number 5, third at 4, 30 and 84, 4 and 3 quarters by a head. Seven's race... hung on, you were right, Kel. 
race Winning spirit. <laughs> the at, at the fourteen dollars race uh, eleven three two one Hoya Bella nine to four five to four on in favour number two Legal Suit Bidgey's Bank third at five to two twenty five ninety eight a half by eight number seven the scratching there the last race twelve Arrows Legend number one at fours Laser Reprisal second at evens and a favourite and five to two number eight Jackie Willow eighteen point zero five three and a half by one and a half don't forget the Canberra Cup heats the nineteen ninety nine Canberra Cup heats will be conducted this coming Tuesday. So that's a Sky and uh, Tab coverage there. Uh, so if you've got nothing to do on uh, Tuesday, you should pop out here. There's uh, the cream of the uh, greyhounds that are going up and down the east coast of Australia will be here contesting the best eight heats over the 5.30 with the final, of course, to be conducted on Sunday the 24th. That's uh, tomorrow week. All right, Paul, I'll uh, catch up with you tonight uh, around the round table. That's it. Thanks for your help. Good, good afternoon you. to you and good afternoon to everyone. Good on you, Kel. Look forward to it, mate. Top coverage as usual there today. Let's get back to Ian.